Hello, I'm Brent Demartini here with Demartini RV, and today I want to show you the 2017 Dynamax Asada 3. This coach is a brand new color here in our showroom. This is the Cabernet exterior. Beautiful color, really nice. And this is the first one that we've gotten with the automatic leveling jack. So I'm going to show you that in a little bit, but for now, let's take a look inside. Here we are on the inside of the Dynamax Asada 324FW. So this is a really great floor plan. It's got a lot of room in here, the most room we've ever had on the Mercedes chassis. So you get that with the full wall slide. It's got the booth. It's got LED row lighting. That really makes it look a lot fancier in here. That booth has a uh, it's got um, pads on the back so that you can sit on there comfortably and watch TV. To the left of the dinette, here's our storage here. You've got pull out for your pantry. Those are all on soft clothes hardware. And you've also got this tall storage down below. And here's your wardrobe with a motion sensor light in there, the booster chair, as well as your privacy shades and the hanging space. That's cedar lined in the back. Some more soft closed drawers. These are also cedar lined. And you get a full walk around queen bed in this floor plan. This is the iCool mattress, which makes it so that it's a little more comfortable to sleep on. You don't get quite as hot. This coach has TVs that run off of an inverter. You've got a nice big TV for the bedroom. It's a 32 inch. And this bathroom is fully accessible with the slide in or out. Very nice bathroom. You have a lot of room in there. They've switched the sinks to undermount countertop sink. You've got nice shower enclosure there with a door that closes off and flexes. This is an upgraded version of the fridge. You've got, it's a two-way fridge that runs off of propane or 110. These handles are nice because you don't have anything to push in it, you just grab. It's a Dometic fridge. And to the left of that, we've got the microwave, convection microwave. So you can cook anything in there pretty much. And down below, you've got this flush mount countertop on the stove cover. That flips back and then once again. And it's a three burner propane stove. Soft closed drawers in the kitchen. And you've got your fuse box and breaker box down below. Over here, you've got two uh, sink covers, so you can either use just most of the sink cover like that and have more counter space, or you could use the whole thing for maximum counter space, or either way, whichever you'd like. And there is a lot of storage down here under the sink, so for trash cans and stuff. And you also have this flip counter space here. So, uh, pretty versatile kitchen for such a small coach here. This coach has the entertainment center up front. And so, you get not only do you get a more sleek uh, profile on the front of the coach on the exterior, but you've also got um, in a lot nicer cabinetry up here to where you can store things. And you've got your entertainment center right here and uh, a TV that you can move out on the swivel to make it easier viewing from the dinette area. So as you can see here in the cockpit we can turn these chairs totally around and they do have booster seats so that you can get up to regular seat level or you can just turn them back around and here we are in the cockpit. So. Now these coaches are coming with smart wheels, so you can access your hands-free device as well as radio controls, volume, stuff like that. Um, over here we've got our 
very nice layout on the on the gauges and you've got a battery boost button over here to the left which comes in handy when you need to jump on low batteries um, and here's the rest of the Mercedes console here we are at the main control panel on the stairwell of the coach. We've got all of our switches nicely laid out here, gauges on, on the side here, generator hour start and stop, water heater features, and your solar controller right here, antenna booster. Then we've got the automatic leveling panel right here. So super easy, touch of a button will level the whole coach with hydraulic levelers. Uh, and don't forget our inverter switch right here. Now down below the step here we've also got our AGM batteries so those are upgraded from your regular 12 volt sealed batteries so these are going to handle the charge a little better and uh, give you a little more amp hours as well. No maintenance on those batteries. Here we are in the exterior of the Asada 3. We've got our quick connect propane valve right here so you can barbecue on the outside of this coach and up above we've got exterior speakers super nice paint job on this coach here's a mount for your TV your bedroom TV can actually quick release and come be mounted out here if you want to watch TV outside uh, furnace you've got your fridge vent there a little bit of storage right here and your propane is right there we've got a 20 gallon tank there and as we go around you can see that what I was talking about with that entertainment center where you get kind of an aerodynamic sleek looking front cab and that's actually probably going to cut down on your gas bill. Another nice feature of the exterior of this coach is that it's a, a awning cover on the slide topper, so you don't have to worry about that uh, rotting out. Got a metal awning cover on it. Here's some ac easy access storage here on the slide itself. Okay, now that we've got the slide in, we can see what the storage looks like on the outside. We've got our exterior side camera right here. This is a good storage compartment here. And that actually opens up a little bit past the door to the right. Hard to see there. But now we've also got this one. When we open that, that's our main storage compartment. So these are all wet storage, so they have drains in them. And over here, we've got our exterior shower as well as some valves for our plumbing, a GFI outlet, and some LED lighting in there. Below that, we've got our propane generator. This is an Onan 3600 watt propane generator. And we've got our tank dump valves and a sewer hose storage. And we've got our plumbing right here for the water connection, cable, satellite wire, and our 30 amp service. The awning on this coach is just a one touch button, so it's super easy. You just push the button, it'll do everything for you. And this does have a wind sensor, so if the coach uh, if the wind around the coach picks up too much, it's going to go back in. You don't have to worry about it. And that has integrated lighting as well. LED lights that go out with the on. This coach is powered by a Mercedes 3 liter V6 diesel engine. It's uh, 188 horse and it's also got about 362 foot pounds of torque. 
So inside here we've, we can see that there's a lot of room left over in this engine compartment because that's such a small engine and that's going to give you some good gas mileage as well as more leg room and uh, it's a very reliable engine it's been around for a long time. Thanks for watching our video on the 2017 uh, Dynamax Asada 3 24FW. If you like the video, please press like and comment below. Uh, if you want to get a special on this coach, uh, why don't you send me an email, brent at demartini.com, or give me a call, 1-800-576-1921. Thanks for watching. Bye!